Welcome to Reanimator Reviews. My name is Rayanne and today I'm going to be talking about Kuzo. It is the 2017 film directed by Steve Ellison. It does take place in LA after an earthquake and presumably some additional horrific events. It is comprised of four stories, Royal, Mr. Quiggle, Smear, and Sock. Royal involves a couple struggle per intimate relations. Mr. Quiggle is a story with two subplots involving a cure-all entity and those who seek his help. Smear centers around a boy who is bullied both at home and at school who then tries to cultivate a new friend. And Sock is a mother's struggle to find her baby with some interesting guidance. All these stories have interludes in between of interesting gross, funny, and sometimes really beautiful live action and animated filler. So the best way to describe this movie, per my perspective, I do watch a lot of Adult Swim. I know a lot of these actors and, you know, the like were involved in it, is waking up around three, four in the morning with a fever, half awake, and kind of laying there while one of their original programs is on just really kind of confused, but also intrigued in the best way possible. So what, what are my likes? This movie knew exactly what it was. And from going into it, knowing who was involved with it, I was ready for it. I wasn't expecting something, you know, Oscar worthy per se. Uh, George Clinton is the freaking man. And I was super excited to see him in this. So nothing was held back. I really did enjoy that. They, they weren't worried about offending people or grossing people out. That, that was kind of their plan and they did a good job. So my dislikes, there was a part with a water pitcher full of, I think it was the farmer's association spit with like a really tight shot on it. And that made me gag a little bit, which is weird with all the poop that's in the movie. That's what got me, but I just, I don't do spit. It's gross. Uh, some of the movie was a little hard to follow, but if you kind of let go of trying to keep track of every single detail and just watched it and enjoyed it for what it was, that made it, you know, it, it was a lot easier that way. And then you would enjoy the film for what it is. So I would rate this movie a 3.5 out of 5. I did really enjoy it. It was a weird movie. I knew it was going to be a weird movie, so I wasn't really surprised. I did find this on Shudder. Uh, from what I read so far, there's no other release on any kind of platform at this moment or like a digital copy or a physical copy. So definitely check it out on Shudder. If you have seen this movie, let me know what you guys thought. I know a lot of people really don't like it. I know um, per the director talking about it being released at a festival, he kind of bragged that a certain percentage of people walked out because it was so gross. And I think he was pretty excited about that. But if you could, you know, leave me your comments down below. Let me know what you think. Like the video if you liked the video. Like the video if you didn't like the video. Uh, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell for all of my notifications, and you can find me on Twitter at Ray Animator and Facebook at Ray Animator Reviews. And have a good day. Enjoy Kuzo.